when it comes to sexual health, I think the challenges are twofold. So you have people who struggle to access services because they can't get appointments, because of long wait times, because of embarrassments, fear of judgments. So there are all those factors. And then there are the people who don't even know they need to access services, right? And that's that kind of lack of awareness and education in general that exists. So whatever it is that we do whether it's in clinic testing or at home testing i think general education needs to be key the benefit of at home testing is that it makes it convenient for people and it removes some of those access barriers confidentiality is is breached in that sense so if somebody receives a preliminary positive test result then they need to have that diagnosis confirmed in a clinic with a second blood sample that's taken from a vein not like a pinprick blood test that you do at home it's a starting point and it gets people thinking along the right lines and it gets infections picked up and hopefully treated much more quickly.